All right, so I have my PC over here. You can't see the full PC, but uh, yeah, these speakers are terrible. I'm going to play a song now so you can hear what I mean. So yeah, the speakers are terrible. Uh, if I don't want to play the music anymore. Um, so what I normally do is I use my Bluetooth earphones. I connect them to the computer whenever I want to listen to music. But um, if you don't have Bluetooth earphones to use, maybe you only have wired earphones and you just don't want to use your earphones anymore. Well, with this app, you can use your phone to play the audio that's coming out from your PC. And I'm going to show you how to use it in this video. All right, so the first thing to do is to install the app. I already have it installed, but I'm going to leave a link to it in the description. After installing it, then you just tap open to open the app. Okay, so the next thing is that um, you need both your Android phone and your Windows computer to be connected to the same Wi-Fi network. So I have both of them connected to the same Wi-Fi network. On the phone, you can tap here and then you tap about. And you're going to see a list of websites that you can visit. So you want to visit this first one. So you can tap home page. It's going to open your browser. So you have to access this website on your PC as well. So you can download the software for your Windows PC. Okay, so this is the website and all you have to do is just come down here to download. You click on it. This only works for Windows PCs. So if you are not using a Windows computer, I'm not really sure of another method for now, but I may do some research on that. So when you get here, you just click here to download this folder. And once you download the folder, you just have to extract the folder. I'll just right click on it. And then I'll click extract all. Next, I'll click this button down here. So this is going to show up. Just double click it to open it and then you click run. So it is now running. You can close these windows. Okay, so first thing you need to do is to click on IP. The software is going to show you a list of IP addresses that you can use. So for this tutorial, I'll be using the first IP address. So back to my phone, I will just head back to this part where I can enter the IP address. Okay, so I'll just click. Okay, so I'll just enter the right IP address. I'm entering the first one. And after entering the address, I'll tap on this arrow up here. It should show a green check mark. Okay, the first address is not working, so I'll try the third one. Maybe it will work. After that, I'll tap here. It should show a green. Okay, yeah, it has connected. So if the first one doesn't work, try the third one and hopefully it will work. You can see down here that um, it has been connected. So I'll play the song now and you'll notice that my phone and the PC will be playing the song. What you can do to stop that is you can tap here. This um, icon down here is going to mute your PC and only your phone will play the sound. So I'm going to have to lower the volume. It's a bit too loud. Wow, it's all the way up. Okay, so... Now the song is coming out from my phone. Uh, let me just move it around so you can maybe hear how the audio is being affected. So one thing that I've noticed is that um, the audio is a bit delayed. So I'll just pause for now. And then if you head over to settings, I'm not sure if this will work for everyone, but uh, what I did was I just disabled compression. I don't know what this compression option means. I'm not too good with audio, like I'm not a sound engineer. So if anyone knows what this compression means, please, you can let me know in the comments. So you can always control the audio from down here as well. You can use this to play. And as you control it from your phone, it's going to display here as well. So if I pause, it should say play slash paused. If I tap the second one, it should stop. Uh, this will go to the previous track, next track, on mute. And this should increase or decrease the volume, I mean. So this is to increase the volume. It's going to affect your PC. And if you tap this, it's going to reduce the volume 
on the PC. So yeah, that is basically how you do it. You can use this app and um, listen to audio or play audio from your PC to your phone. If you want it to stop, you can always tap on this green button up here and it's going to get disconnected. And whenever you play audio, it's going to play just on your PC. So that's how you do it. Thank you guys for watching. If you found the video helpful, please give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this.